Hi. Yeah, I'm just getting home right now. Well, okay, I guess I'll see you soon then. Uh, when you get here, just honk the horn and I'll come right out and uh, help you with the groceries, okay? I love you too. <laughs> Bye. Um, hello? Person in my house? Am I on a show or something? Oh my goodness, where are my manners? I'm Lawrence. Lawrence Soto, interim death. And you must be the new death? Wait a minute, I'm dead? No, you're death. You see, oh my god, this never happens, but it's right here. If, while performing the duty of administering death, the administrator accidentally administers death upon his or herself at the exact time and place of the scheduled administration, all duty and responsibility of the occupation of death transfers to the intended administrator. But that isn't... well, I, I'm not... what is that book? Anyway, I, I, I can't be death. I have a wife and a, and a job and everything. We were gonna get a Labradoodle. Hmm. No, you see... We took you out of the system when you became deaf, so we had to provide a replacement. But don't worry, it's all pretty seamless. Here, come take a look. Who's that guy? That's not me. Who's that guy with my wife? That's his wife. We should go. Can you take a walk with me? It's my shirt. That's his shirt. So, what questions do you have? <laughs> what, are you kidding? I have all the questions. I mean, what am, actually am I supposed to do? Okay, so, that guy over there with the hat, mm -hmm. at the time it says on your sheet, you're gonna go over there and touch him. So in a minute, when I tell you, you're just gonna walk over there and touch him on the shoulder. He's gonna die instantly of a heart attack. All right, so that's it, all I have to do is touch him. What if, uh, what if he doesn't, what if they don't die of a heart attack? What if someone uh, dies in a car crash or a knife fight? It's your first day. We'll stick with natural causes, okay. Go touch him now. Wait, what if I don't kill him? Does he does he live? Do I get a choice? You don't kill him. Nobody kills him. He dies of a heart attack. Your job is just to administer death at the proper time, which is now. So touch him on the shoulder. Uh, you touch him. You're the interim death. I'll uh, I'll get the next one. Oh, okay. <laughs> Oh, I didn't think you were actually going to do it. You shouldn't have done that. He's gonna die, everyone dies, but if you don't do what you're supposed to do, when you're supposed to do it, it always ends up worse. Look out! Ah! Oh my god! Oh, it's so gross! Oh, I can see my bones! So how long do I have to keep doing this? Forever. Well, unless you were to accidentally administer death to yourself at the exact time and place of a scheduled administration, but that almost never happens. Well, this is literally the worst. <laughs> Couldn't have said it better myself. And I gotta tell you, it's not all heart attacks in the park, like the white, foodborne illness, mm. whenever you're ready. Can you believe it's already been a year? I can't believe it's only been a year. You're my whole world, baby. I can't imagine my life without you. Happy anniversary. Oh, honey, it's beautiful. Not doing it. Find somebody else. This is too depressing. There's no somebody else. <laughs> Your death, you decide when people die, or they die just whenever, and we saw how that goes. There, you gotta. I think 
I'm gonna go slip into something a little more comfortable. I'm gonna slip into not wearing pants. You know the longer you wait, the more awkward this is gonna be when you do it. Hey, I'm proud of you. Stop. No, I'm serious, you're gonna be a good dad. Okay, fine. I'll do it. I'll be death. Give me the robe. Oh, the robe is a personal choice. We don't really have like a strict dress code. He took it very seriously. Okay, okay, then uh, the clipboard. Give me the clipboard. I want to uh, get on with my eternity. You sure you're ready for this? Eh. All right, death. Go get him. You have my card? Call with anything. Thanks, Lawrence. This would have been so much more horrifying without you. Oh! I almost forgot. Got this for you. It's to check your times. <laughs> I, I shouldn't really touch you. Bye, Lawrence! <laughs>